Big Pimpin', baby. What's up, everybody? This is your boy K Ray. And today, I um, just want to talk about my new uh, smoker I got from Lone Star Grills. Vertical uh, insulated smoker. Um, what I'm going to do is unpack it and just go over a few details uh, with you guys on it. Also, I purchased me a Weber, got to have that, um, definitely can expand your, your cooking skills with one of these, so I got this, um, it's already a lot of reviews about the Webers online, so I'm not going to do, talk about that um, too much, um, I just throw in a few things once I do my first cook on it, so let me unwrap uh, a vertical smoker here and I will be back with some details on it later all right everybody I am back and I got her unpacked and man she's looking good um, as you can see it's got full front both the doors and uh, uh, the firebox area is all stainless steel. Charcoal basket area, rather. Not a firebox in here, it's charcoal basket. Uh, it's all stainless steel. Everything is a uh, uh, 11 gauge uh, metal, all brand new. Fully insulated all the way around. smokestack up top right here pretty nice right here got a phone where I could put my water in without opening the door I think that's one really really cool accessory uh, that's one here um, true tail temp gauge they're pretty accurate got all my bow valves over here in the back right there two inch bow valve that controls the airflow right here one and a quarter inch bow valve and um, I added a 90 degree elbow fitting on it so uh, my water can drain uh, straight down out of there so that is the valve for the for the water pan to drain the water out and right here is just an extra um, fitting that you know if I need more airflow or whatever I can just add another ball valve to it and it, it'll be operational pit comes pretty standard slam door latches with locks on them let's open everything up see what we got got a lot of room in there slide out trays all four of them I think they like about five inches apart and will hold uh, two full aluminum foil pans in there, which is cool. I think all together this thing is probably close to uh, a little bit over 2,500 uh, square inches, which is a lot of cooking. I can do a lot of cooking on it. Down here, that's where the water pan is at made out of quarter inch steel we'll go to water valve where the water drop will um, drain out it right there in the corner I think I put about eight gallons of water in here that's what uh, Chris told me got insulation on the side and on the front everything nice wheels on the inside this thing here is pretty nice gonna cook really really efficient too slam door locks pretty cool down here you'll see my charcoal basket and my um, trash see my um, 
ash pan as well. It's pretty beefy. You can hold up to 40 pounds of charcoal at one time. So, talking to the builder over at Long Star Grills, he said he put 40 pounds of charcoal in here, just all charcoal, and it ran for like 30 hours straight at 225. So that, that's pretty awesome. And one other thing is like on the inside, you get equal distribution of heat from top to bottom. Um, I saw him over there um, with one. He was seasoning it for the customer. And man, that thing was like on target. Every every rack was the same uh, temp. That's that's pretty amazing. I thought so. Over here, I just got a couple of upgrades. Stainless steel shelf. Good for prep or whatever you want to do. And uh. And a stainless steel handle on now to uh, move it around. Uh, move it around with it's pretty cool. Weigh about 800 pounds, but still uh, pretty easy to move with the handle and the wheels. I also got like the upgraded wheels. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. I'm back. Had to close that. Um, charcoal basket with with two hands it's pretty heavy but anyway as i was saying before i got to upgrade it run flat um eight inch wheels on here makes it a little bit easier to move and also i got barbecue guru cyber cube setup that i'm gonna use on here got the adapter and everything for the bow valve so with this, with my plans with this is just to, when I do long cooks, I can just set this and forget it. I can give me some sleep now instead of, you know, cooking on my, my stick burn right there. So, but uh, that's about it. And, uh, you know, when I do my first cook, definitely um, show everybody that. So this, this is my new little... Uh, baby right here that I'm adding to my arsenal my barbecue arsenal so I can do some uh, Really nice cooks uh, for you guys uh, this summer So that's basically it K Ray this K Ray K Ray's Q Southern style barbecue southern cooking So I uh, appreciate everybody stopping by uh, checking out uh, This review of my new grill Appreciate it later okay one other thing that I failed to mention is that uh, the shelf it is fold down so you see I can fold it down put it on the side won't take up nothing but another inch of space so I think that's pretty cool too alright later